So hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel i hope you guys are doing great and today's video i'm going to talk about how you can create that kind of underwater scene so in this video i'm just going to talk about only how you can create these beautiful rays by the way so now let's start a tutorial so first of all i'll just start a new project file let's do it so all right guys here you can see we have opened a new project file and we have already created one little scene here basically here you can see we have a one cube here where we are gonna create our rays and we have a little uh water scene here we have a pebbles and we have a little sand background which is we are gonna use it all right so first of all let me do control z and here i have already added two plane which is uh, gonna create a little uh noise effect in this scene basically let me show you how i create this this is very easy and cool by the way let me uh switch into the ev so we can see easily what's going on here and for making this video we are going to use a ev basically so here you can see we have created some noise effect here which is uh created like this here you can see we have added a Warnoid texture, we have added a noise texture and uh, this is very simple thing so I'm not going to explain much more about this thing because okay which is uh, everybody knows by, by the way so I'm not gonna uh, get into this thing by the way we are just gonna only stick with how we can create a race effect using the blender okay so for that what i'm gonna do i'm just gonna select my cube here and i'll just uh, change uh, first of all on uh, this um visibility as a wire so we can see the background easily yeah and first of all we'll just change your background color okay and you can use the same uh color code which is i'm using here if you want to do it you will get a same effect which is i'm going to show you here so if you want to use it you can use it yeah so our background color is looking look nice now i'm just going to add a new texture node here which is like a principal bsdr let me change this principal bsdr as a principal volume yeah something like that and here we'll also change the color so now what i'm gonna do again you can use the same color code if you want to use it 4c6 da yeah this is a good color by the way yeah and now what i'm gonna do i'm just gonna change this node as surface to volume and here you can see that volume effect is gonna start and i'm just going on my camera view so we can see what's going on here right now we can't see anything but it's okay we have we need to add some node here and after that we can see same kind of rays effect which is we have seen before so now i'm just going to add one node here it's called uh, volume absorption yeah and i'm just gonna add one more node it's called basically mix shader yeah i'm gonna put it here and i'll just plug it this here to here yeah everything look nice to me right now now what i'm gonna do i'm just gonna again add one color code here uh seven six e five t f yeah that's so cool and we'll just change the amount 0 0.01 and here we'll also change the amount 0 0.07 and we'll also change the anastrophe okay we'll also change the anastrophe amount 0 0.05 uh, no 0 0.5 only yeah yeah everything is look nice to me but still we can't see anything happening here so now what we have to do we have to just change the amount here first of all and after that we'll just change only one thing and it's gonna create a beautiful raise effect so what we have to do we have to just decrease the emission strength and here we go guys here you can see we have a perfect and beautiful rays here here you can see i'm just going to increase the emission we can't able to see but when i'm just going to decreasing the emission strength we can see these perfect and beautiful water rays effect now let me explain one thing also make sure you just use the uh spotlight and make sure you just add the power at least two megawatt make sure not only watt megawatt because uh if you don't have a high intensity uh, of light then maybe you will not 
able to create the same these kind of raising effect because creating these kind of raising effect we need high intensity of a light basically so make sure to increase the intensity of your light so you might be get a result same which is you are gonna seeing here right now so let's uh, i hope you enjoyed this video that's very easy and cool trick so i thought i should share with you guys so thanks for watching this video guys if you learn something in this video please hit the like button and the share button and subscribe my channel also if you have any queries if you have any suggestions please let me know in the comment box i'll definitely reply comment so bye bye take care and stay home guys